wonderful child of God. We thank God for your life. We trust that you are having a fabulous day. May the Lord God bless you. We are coming your way with another package of Be Encouraged. We want to just take a moment and pray with you. Father, we thank you and we bless you. We honor you. We give you praise and glory for giving us this day. Your word made us to understand that this is the day you have made. And we are to rejoice and be glad in it. We take dominion of this day and beyond in the mighty name of Jesus. And we declare everything blessed in Jesus' name we pray. May your house be blessed. May your marriage be blessed. Whatever that you are involved in, we declare in the name of Jesus, you receive the covering of the Lord in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Today we want to share something little with you. In the book of Psalms, in the book of Psalms, verse chapter 38, and we're going to read a couple of verses, and we believe that it's going to bless your heart. Book of Psalm 34, rather, 34. Book of Psalm 34. And this is what Bible says from verse number 4. I sought the Lord. I sought the Lord. And he helped me and delivered me from all my fears. All my fears. Whatever fear that may be happening in your life, whatever that you are going through, whatever that is challenging you, he says that when he sought the Lord, when you allow God into the situation, the situation has no choice but to give up. Because when God comes in, everything changes. Now, let me finish reading it. He says, I saw the Lord and he heard me and delivered me from all my fears. Now, listen to this. He says that they looked to him and were radiant and their faces were not ashamed. Listen, this poor man cried out and the Lord heard him. And listen to this. And he saved him out of all his trouble. The angels of the Lord encamp and comes all around those who fear him and delivers them. Child of God, we want to tell you this that no matter what you are going through, you have a great God. Situation may be tough, may be very challenging, in some cases unbearable. But don't throw in the towel yet. Allow God in. Because Bible tells us, with God, maybe that scripture has not yet come into your full understanding. But it says, with God, all things are possible. So I believe that is why Bible says that he says he sought the Lord. Have you gone before the Lord? Or have you taken it on your own way? My dear brother, my dear sister, you're going to get tired. Let us speak something into your life. Go before the Lord. Bible says yes, that with prayer, with supplication, with thanksgiving, let our request be made known to God. Not anything but to God. So we want to encourage you today. Don't give up. You are redeemed. He says yes, that and the Lord will redeem you from all of them. So let's finish this in this verse. Verse number 22. He says yes, that the Lord redeems the soul of a servant and none of those who trust him shall be condemned may the lord god bless you may the lord god lift you up above all things the key word here is i sought the lord and he delivered me let god take the burden he says cast all your burden upon me and then he says i will take care of you May the Lord God bless you and lift you up above all things. May all the burdens that you are carrying yourself be lifted up in the name of Jesus as you seek the face of God. May everything around you receive the backing of the Lord in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. We bless you in Jesus' name for redeeming your children from anything that is challenging them in Jesus' mighty name. And remember, Above all, conquer fear, find hope, and be encouraged. Amen. God bless you.